Today we're staying at the world's number one rated capsule hotel that let me tell you takes things to an entirely different level from not only the award-winning design of the capsule but also the insane high-tech features most unique transportation method I've ever seen of getting to a hotel to things I still cannot believe now normally when getting to a capsule hotel or a hotel in general I would take an uber ride but here in Amsterdam being home to over 160 canals that stretch 60 miles long boat travel is not only the most unique but outright the coolest way to get anywhere here in Amsterdam. Now, we rented a boat today, but the only problem is we both have never driven one before. Hello. Hi, hello. We, uh, we made a reservation. Yes. We'll be right. Yes. Yeah. They're a great boat for us today. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. You have the Queen Elizabeth. That's oh, the Queen Elizabeth. <laughs> okay. Never awesome. Seen. Sweet. Oh, who's <laughs> going to be the captain? Who's gonna be the captain? Sure. <laughs> Most people make it, so it's okay. <laughs> Good to know. Yeah. Yeah. We had one time some German people, uh, they were really drunk and yeah. they shake the boat. Oh no! And he fell down. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> right. Cool. Okay, see you. Bye. Yeah, I'm like really surprised at like how easy it was to get that. Yeah. No, I was like, is he gonna ask like if we have a boating license or if we've ever done this before? Oh. Wow, don't rock the boat. <laughs> this boat turns over. I go down with it. I am the captain. <laughs> What are you what are you pointing at? The way. <laughs> okay, so so we just stopped off here just to like find our place and these goose are just staring at us. We come in peace. Okay, they are coming very close to the boat. Oh my god, Lucille, Lucille! We have to go. Jeez, these guys are crazy. Now arriving in the city, of course it's beautiful, but something super cool is there's different things you can do along the canals here. For example, we just passed something I've never seen before of a pizza takeout window on the canal. And although I love pizza and find these places so freaking cool, I found another place of where they make junk food items healthy. And we have got pretty much everything they're famous for on their menu. We have the sumo burger here, the waffle fries, the insane loaded french fries, which I can't even see anything below the jalapenos and cheese and the Dutch specialty of the fried butterballen. Now the reason why this is considered healthy junk food is their mission is to use locally sourced ingredients and home make everything. And honestly I've never seen anything like that before that's deemed healthy. I'm going for the sumo burger. <laughs> I can hardly pick this thing up like oh my god. So as we finish up our delicious food right here, we have about like 10 minutes before getting to the capsule. And before we get there, we have to finish our food right here. And I also wanted to tell you guys about my favorite shoes, Vessies, which in my opinion are the best shoes for travel and just everyday life. So first, my absolute favorite thing about these shoes is they're 100% waterproof. So whether you put it in a puddle or literally the river, your feet stay dry. Also, and I say this with the utmost appreciation, but these shoes are the comfiest shoes I've ever worn. They literally fit like a sock. And also, these are the most lightweight shoes I have ever worn, which let me tell you, while traveling is super important. And also, they're super stylish with, of course, this one coming in black, but also all of these colors as well. So if you'd like to go pick up these shoes and also get $40 off, go to Vessi.com backslash Living Bobby. Really guys, I freaking love these shoes. They're 100% vegan and literally everything you would ever want in a shoe. But anyway, be sure to go check them out with the link in the description box below. And also this is great timing because we are officially arriving. Uh, we found a parking spot. <sighs> that has to be the coolest way of transportation. It's automated, it's so cool. Oh cool. wow. Oh, do, you want, do you want a top or a bottom? I don't know. What, what would you suggest, top or a bottom? <laughs> Yeah, if you're gonna drink much, then a button is better. <laughs> dive in. <laughs> yeah. It's actually the same space. We have to climb in or okay. dive in. Awesome. Okay. I think I'd like to go for a top uh, one. Yeah, same, yeah, same, yeah. same. Cool. That's so cool. Super cool. Cool. Take one of these. What mood? Love, sun, luck, luck or, or dancing? <laughs> I'm gonna go dancing. <laughs> 
Okay, finished check-in. Sweet, so we can just uh, go yeah, to the capsule. I can okay. explain a little bit about uh, the oh. hotel as well. So yeah, this is absolutely. The, the Wi-Fi for inside. Okay. Uh, this is the wristband for the door, but yes. also if you want something from the bar, the coffee machine, vending machine, you can just scan your wristband and then you can make yourself a drink over Oh, there. no way. There so are some cool. snacks as well, you can also get it with the wristband. Wow, nice. so cool. And in the night you can uh, open this door, but it's also a night host, so it will Got be it. Okay. And you can download the City Hub app on your phone, which will give you a way to yeah, control the app. And you will see my face, and then you can say, hi Steven, I'm over here, and I'm, I'm chatting uh, from here. Oh, that's so cool. And I can see your location as well, so you can say, okay, we're walking here, is there a place to swim close by or what's your favorite uh, coffee spot in this hood or anything you want to know wow, okay. and then I can send you some uh, suggestions. Awesome, wow, well that, that seems like the most high-tech experience we've ever had. <laughs> Sweet, okay, thank you so much, yeah, we'll be talking to you soon, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Arriving to these lockers, it was an interesting feel of a modern yet high-tech design of being super sleek but insanely spacious. However, not gonna lie, after the boat ride, I was a bit sweaty. So first, I had to check out the supposedly famous bathrooms. Now, arriving to the shower room, I had quite high expectations. And honestly, with those expectations, I was still truly blown away. The shower room itself seemed like something out of a design magazine, with having a beautiful rustic feel while also keeping that modern design. Now, the shower itself was not only spotless clean, but seriously, the most detail-oriented shower room I've ever seen. And honestly, the same vibe I found in the bathroom, with having these beautifully ceiling to floor sinks, and all also these super fun shaped urinals. But anyway, after taking far too many pictures with the urinals, Lucille and I found ourselves looking for our capsule. Wow. So nice. So cool. I like this tiny street here. <laughs> this tiny street. They're so big. It yeah. feels like we're in like a like a village or something like that. It is really big. I really like the natural light coming in. Yeah, yeah. I've never actually had like natural light in a capsule before, so this is yeah. so cool. Like it's just like coming all in here. This is so cool. Oh my God. Um, you just take the mood and will you have disco lights? <laughs> Disco lights going off to welcome us. Okay, now starting downstairs here. I can't even believe I'm saying downstairs in the capsule yeah. hotel. There's of course the beautiful door here where you have to enter with your wristband. It's really cool that they have a full length mirror as well. Yeah, this is insane. I've never seen such a large like formed capsule hotel. Yeah, like this. one thing I really like and I think it's like really cool is like that they give you kimono. Work. Like if you want to walk around and like go to the bathroom or something. Yeah. Or maybe like dance in them. <laughs> Moving along. So not even at the bed itself, but over here, there's a beautiful storage area where you can put your bags here or anything else that you want. Okay, Lucille, do you want to go up the stairs? Of course. I never thought I could say that in a capsule. <laughs> such a little staircase. Okay, this is honestly the coolest thing ever, but possibly one of the coolest things about this room is the light control. So right now the disco lights are on because we set it in dance party. But if we open the app here, you can actually turn the lights however you want them. Sunset feature. Wow. Forest feature. <laughs> Romance feature. And along with that, you can make any of the settings your wake up light. So you just set your wake up timer here to, I don't know, say like eight o'clock. And if you really want to be woken up with, let's say, purple dark light, you can do that. One other really cool feature is this. So you can connect to the Bluetooth no way. speakers of the capsule oh, hotel, oh, which yeah. is super cool. Like if you're watching a movie, like you kind of have like the sound like everywhere around right. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So something that's really cool about this capsule that I've never seen at all in any other capsule is it's practically soundproof. Here, there's literally, there's a window with like this glass here that's completely soundproof. And so that is how you can have a speaker in the room. Well, two speakers. You have two speakers. You have surround sound in this capsule. <laughs> now, in terms of absolutely the most important feature, 
the bed. It's so comfy. I don't want to move. Yeah, like what's really cool, oh. and I can touch it here. Yeah. It's like they have like one normal mattress. Okay. And one like foam layer on top of it to make oh, it Oh, nice wow. Comfy. Yeah, that's so true. That's so awesome, yeah. So if you see here, this is a completely separate layer from the actual bed itself. Now, in terms of the size of the bed, 1.5 bobby rolls. <laughs> okay, so one and a half bobby rolls for a capsule hotel is absolutely insane. But just to demonstrate the actual size of this place too, just let me do a couple more measurements here. So if you really wanted to, for example, I don't know, do yoga in your capsule hotel? You could do that. Or if you'd like to do something, I don't know what I'm doing, but I can do it here. <laughs> you can do it anyway. And now this capsule is built for two people, but if you were one, you could literally spread out like a starfish here. <laughs> I love how efficient this is, you know, here like the hangers are like made into the clothing racks. Oh, that's so, so true. Fall. I didn't even notice that. That's yeah. so awesome. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah. I need I to get some of those hangers. <laughs> and also like, aren't you feeling that it's air conditioned in here yes. as well? That is not typical. <laughs> not typical of a capsule. Here, there's not a vent, but a huge like area for air conditioning. It's really cool, like I can stand up straight in the bed. I was like scared of like, you know, like only being able to be like. <laughs> right, yeah, like I, I'm six foot three and me sitting in the bed, I have, a, well, not too much space, but, but, but a lot of space for a capsule. Normally I'm like, hey guys. There's only one plug normally here. You have two plugs. So one plug on both sides and a USB port. And also over here, you have two more plugs. So Lucille, for you, you've never stayed in a capsule. No. How, how would you rate this capsule here? Oh, I love it. I, I think like everything is so clean and so modern. Mm -hmm. So yeah. yeah, like is it in like 